Good morning, Mark. It's Anthony from Bustards. Uh, like I said, wanted to send you this video. Hopefully the noise isn't too bad. It's a little bit windy here in Waterloo right now. Uh, these guys are looking pretty crappy, but eh, it's winter. What are you going to do? So anyway, the Jeep is right beside me here. Uh, this is running uh, some pretty hefty. These are KO2 BF Goodrich. Uh, size is 285 7017. Uh, awesome, awesome tire. Really makes the, the Jeep stand out here. Uh, just looking the outside, I didn't notice any damage, which is always a good thing. So it looks like it was well taken care of. Uh, nothing on that side. And the front looks good too. So it's running a 3.6 V6 with the, the manual transmission, as we were talking about on the phone. Uh, just looking on the inside here. So you're going to have the ability to take the doors off. Uh, it's manual windows. I'll just jump in the Jeep here. It's got a couple of cool features. It is a six-speed. And of course, with a, a Jeep, you're going to have that two-wheel high, two-wheel, uh, sorry, two-wheel high, four-wheel high, four-wheel low. Uh, this will have the traction control button. So if you get in sticky situations, you still have that ability to kind of rock the vehicle and gently and get it out. DC plug-in here that's active when the Jeep is running. Uh, basic radio, but believe it or not, a CD player. So um, I know I had tons of CDs when I was younger, and uh, this is uh, this is surprising to see in there. So it's always good to have a CD player. Uh, you also have freedom panels, so these two guys pop out very easily, and then they store in the back there, and you have that open air feeling. Uh, nice thing too is all the padding around this, so that's not usual uh, to find in a Wrangler. Uh, so good deal on that one too. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me, manual uh, drivers and passenger side, like I said, windows, manual locks. Uh, you do have your owner's manual in here with the wheel lock, so that is uh, fantastic. Uh, and then uh, just above us here is uh, the two speakers for the sound system. And uh, you've got the screws here that uh, help you take off the entire roof if you need to. Uh, you also had a question on like, um, the child seat. So yes, it'll absolutely fit back here. When I take you around to the back of the Jeep, you'll see the anchors and it does have the latch system there for the car seat. So you're all set to go. Um, oh, can't forget this. So because it is uh, a two door Wrangler, you also get the lockable armrest. So it'll give you a nice uh, spot to put stuff here as well as a deep well in here and you have another DC plug-in that is active um, all the time. So let me just show you in the back here. Uh, one of the great features is that you're going to be able to flip the seat forward and then slide forward here. Um, driver's side looks like it's sticky right now but you can slide forward like that and you have access to the second row and that's uh, the same thing for the passenger. You can slide it forward if you need it to. On the back end here, got all of your mats. This of course pops open. Uh, here is the anchor system for the car seat, so you can put two in there. This does flip forward and then flip forward again, so you get additional space and you can actually take that seat out. So you get all of that space in there. <clears throat> Just underneath here is uh, additional storage and that's where all the bolts go for the roof and the doors. Um, your jack will live under there as well. And yeah, you're all set. So that's kind of the highlights on the, uh, the Wrangler. We'd love to have you come down, have a test drive. Uh, I guarantee you're going to love it. Looking forward to working with you, Mark. Have a great day. Thanks.